this is Stampy and welcome to a Minecraft Let's Play video. Today I am playing a round of Hunger Games and this is an amazing new map uh, that was just uh, released for the uh, the Xbox edition of Minecraft and it's called Spring to Life which I love the name as well and it's basically a big garden, well a big field kind of, you can see there's all blades of grass and there's bees over there, there's a big dandelion and a massive bunny over in the distance and a, a bumblebee up there, oh actually is that a wasp? Either a wasp or a bumblebee over there. So yeah, it's a very uh, bright and colourful and green map. And it was built by uh, Castle Crafters. And uh, along here you can see here the rules, no breaking blocks, minute grace period, uh, leave once you die, have fun and enjoy. Uh, subscribe to Castle Crafters and Team Ripples as well apparently. And uh, over here there is a, uh, another sign with uh, all of the builders. Uh, so let me go and uh, hop over to here quickly and uh, just give them a, a big shout out. So yeah, uh, this is the, the Wall of Credit. And so here are all the uh, the creators of the map. I'm not going to read through them all because, yeah, I'll probably slaughter all their gamer tags and uh, muck up uh, reading them. But yeah, these are the uh, the main builders of the map. And so yeah, anyway, that's enough talking about the map. Let's go and play it. I should probably talk about who my opponents are going to be. We are doing all the all. And I'm being joined by Longbow, uh, Chloe, Firadub, uh, Finball, Tankmat, Superchatch, uh, and Jake on the Xbox. So I believe everybody seems to be ready. Uh, so I'm going to hop into my host pod down here. Is everyone ready? Yep, everyone seems to be jumping up and down. Wait for me. I oh, know Chatch is the last one to get the, to the pod. <laughs> At least I wasn't the last one. And he is in. So let's begin in three, two, one. Go, 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 go. And let's go straight to the middle and try and get the chest. I've got a web, a fish. I've got a load of rubbish here. I've got a, an axe, I guess. Um, let's go up here. Oh, stone sword, gold ingot, some bread, and another stick. Uh, I might as well stay here for as long as I can just because... Oh, no. There was an iron ingot there, but someone got it before me. That would have been good. Uh, but yeah, because there's a minute grace period, it doesn't really matter about uh, darting off anywhere too quickly at the beginning. We've got uh, a minute to, to wander around the map and sort of uh, get some some resources before the, the game begins properly. And look at that flying fish. <laughs> See the fish there diving out of the water? Do you reckon there's a chest under here? I reckon there's got to be one hidden down there somewhere. I can see uh, Chloe darting off in that direction over that way. Uh, let's go and have a wander this direction. It's always good to kind of go off by yourself uh, because if you're following after someone else then they're going to be looting uh, all of the, the good chests and uh, then that way, uh, yeah, you're not going to end up with anything. And this is a sneaky chest. Oh, that's not even a chest. That's a, that's a crafting table. I've not used uh, this texture pack very much so I might start getting confused. The problem with this texture pack is I always get confused between oh, iron and um, yeah, I always get confused between iron and stone swords and stuff. I got some good loot here. I got three iron ingots. So if I hop back down to my crafting table, I can make myself an iron sword. And there we go. I got myself a nice big iron sword here so I can try and fend some people off. Uh, there's quite a few people close to me, so I want to be careful. But I also got some poison and uh, some steak as well and some bread. So let's go and grab all of this stuff. And uh, let's go and try and get some armor then, shall we? I'm, I'm currently going stampy style. I've only got my nice little boots on, but uh, it'd be good to, to try and get some, some more protection to try and help my Myself out and whoa look at this stuff I'm gonna take the stone sword so no one else can steal it I got a potion there and a few arrows and some bottles of enchanting I think there was a um an enchantment table in the in the middle of the the map so I could maybe go to that and what's this a potion of swiftness here I'm not entirely sure if we're in the the grace period yet there's a one minute grace period and I'm not sure if we're we're still in it I can see I've been closed there hiding behind something in the in the distance I don't think she wants to deal with me yet so she's decided uh, to run off and something that I could do is that I could try and um, make myself a bow if I want there we go I've made myself a, a bow there we go I, I never normally do any crafting in hunger games it's kind of kind of cool to, to start doing that. So there we go. I've got some bow and arrows now and I can put my helmet on and uh, I might go and try and get some more iron because I've already got three pieces. I might actually be able to uh, craft myself some some iron armor would be nice, uh, quite nice. And look, there's a bee there and a, a massive sunflower. And let's go and have a look around the map then for a little bit. Uh, all of my Hunger Games are normally half me playing to win and half just sort of having a look around all of these, these pretty places. So uh, let's go and have a look at it because this map looked absolutely amazing. I had a, a quick fly over it before we started and uh, seeing it from above looks absolutely uh, amazing. And I'm getting quite a lot of good stuff here. I got four iron. Could I I think I could I make an iron helmet with that maybe? I think I can make a, an iron helmet or some iron boots but I don't really want to do that because right, I've already got a helmet and boots so I might uh, wait until I've managed to get some more and try and make uh, some leggings or uh, or a chest plate. And I'll let see there's a bird there and a massive bird bath and stuff. This map is absolutely amazing isn't it? It, do, it does look uh, so nice. I might at the, uh, the end of the Hunger Games go for a, uh, a quick fly over it so you can 
see it all from above. I don't believe, though, that anyone's died yet. We're definitely out of grace period now, so uh, the battle should have commenced, but it seems like everyone's sort of playing safe. It is quite a big map, though, so you would kind of expect some people to have met, and there's a few googlies down here in this little tunnel. It looks like a little mole hole or something, doesn't it? Right, no one's following me. Let's go in here and see if there's going to be uh, any good loot. I guess all I really need now is the possibility of getting a diamond sword, but I don't even know if there are any diamonds on the map. And uh, also getting some some more armor, maybe some better iron armor. And look, it's massive down here. I thought it was just going to be a little tiny hidden bit, but it's huge. And there's a whole load of googlies I want to be careful about. Look at them, they're all over the place. Oh no, I'm not going to get killed by googlies, am I? That's not good, right? Don't look at the enderman. I'm not looking at you, enderman. Leave me alone, leave me alone. <laughs> it could actually be worth taking it out to try and get an ender pearl. Uh, ender pearls are actually really helpful in Hunger Games. And here we go, more iron as well. Uh, I didn't really need that gold, so... Uh, yeah, if I go and try and find a crafting table now, I think I might be able to, to make some leggings, I think. Uh, let's get out of here then, because I'm too scared that a creeper's just going to go and blow me up, and that would be just the, the saddest way to go. There's one too many googly down here, so let's go and see if we can uh, find an exit. I don't think I've been this way. There's a zombie there. I'm just going to ignore him and run past, and... Oh, look! An iron sword! I got a spare iron sword and a chainmail helmet as well. It's probably worth coming down here then. And I think there is... Is, is that person down? There's someone very close by... I don't know if they know where I am yet. I don't know if they're... I think they, I think they have They have come down here in this cave. Or are they above me? Oh, no. They, they, they are on the other side. They're just directly above where I am. Uh, how did... How did I... How do I get out of here, then? Is the only... Is the only way out the way I came in, then? Uh, I think it might be, then. Let's go back this way, the, the way I came, and uh, see if we can find our way out. Oh, no, there's a creeper! I don't think he saw me. Just hanging out on top of the mushroom down there. I like it down here. It's all kind of massive and magical. Uh, anyway, let's go and try and find my way out. Let's go this way. I don't know if this is the way I came in, but I can see sunlight. Oh, there's a little chest down there. Oh, look, more iron as well, and a stick in case I need it, and another arrow. I found quite a lot of good loot down here, so I think it did uh, help me out coming down here, but uh, there are too many googlies. So let's go and leave now. And look at that butterfly. Can you see that massive butterfly in the distance? There we go. Look at the size of that thing. It's huge. I do feel like a little burrower, like a, just a little man wandering around the place down here. It's quite cool. Uh, what I might do then is I might use all of my... Um, my bottles of enchanting and uh, see if I can uh, enchant uh, my sword would be a good idea but I'm scared someone's going to sneak up on me, are we good? Okay, I don't think anyone knows where I am let's splash all of these down and then let's go and enchant my sword, no one's, I'm so paranoid someone's going to run up behind me and take me out uh, so let me go and throw my iron sword in here and uh, let's just go for anything this will do there we go, I got, I got some knockback on my sword which uh, is pretty handy if uh, someone runs in close to me and yep, still no one's sneaking up on me alright, so let's go, is there a crafting table here actually? Although there isn't, I thought there'd be a crafting table in the middle but it doesn't seem the, that there is so uh, let's wander off again and try and find a crafting table and uh, let's see if I can um yeah if I can craft some some iron armor shall we and I still don't believe anyone has died but look what I've found look it's a massive picnic table there's a big ant here eating I think there's some some crisps you might be eating there's a big radio over there <laughs> this map is so cool it's weird seeing the little animals wandering around there isn't it <laughs> is there anything in this chest uh, as an apple I might as well take that uh, a bit, of, a bit of spare food, I guess. Uh, I really want to find a, a crafting table. There's two people running into each other there. And uh, I feel quite good because I've got this iron sword. But uh, the fact that I've already found two and there seems to be so much iron, I reckon like pretty much everyone's going to have an iron sword. So uh, let's go see if we can find a crafting table. Then once I've got some uh, some better armor, then I can go in for my for my first battle. Uh, yeah, we can carry on looking around the, the map as well. Where are they? I saw so many crafting tables all close together on the other side of the map. But I can't see any over over here. There's either, there's either a chest or a crafting table down there. I mean, there we go. Tank Matt was slain by Super Chat. We've had the first person go down and here is a crafting table here. Uh, so let's go and crouch and let's see what, what iron armor I can make. There we go. I can make some, some iron leggings. So all I need now is a chest plate. And then I'm going to be fully armoured up. And what's in this chest down here? Nope, that one's already been looted. Right, okay, I feel more confident though. I'm looking better. I look a bit weird. I look weird with this helmet. It kind of makes it look like my eyes are cross-eyed or something. <laughs> cross-eyed or not, I'm going to be ready to go in for the fight. Oh, there's a chest up here as well. Probably been looted, but I might as well have a quick look. Oh, look, more iron. I've got, I've got loads of good stuff in here, actually. Ball of enchanting and some arrows. No one's sneaking up on me, are they? Nope, I think we're all good. I think we're all good. So let's go and get my... Uh, splash potion of regeneration. Uh, let's go there, get that 
that at hand just in case I need it. So I got swiftness, regeneration, uh, and harming. I just need to I just need to make sure I don't accidentally muddle them up. That would be the the only issue. And oh look, there's more stuff behind here. Another bottle of enchanting. Another splash potion of swiftness. And I'm gonna take that helmet. Uh, I've got one anyway, but that way just no one else can uh, steal it from me. And let's go and get the uh, the other splash potion of swiftness ready. So uh, if needs uh, be. Well, I can run away very quickly. And a cooked fish, some more arrows, bottles of enchanting. There's loads of good loot all over the place over here, isn't there? Anyway, let's go Let's go try and track someone down. I think the battle uh, went on over in this direction somewhere. So if I sort of head this way and uh, keep taking a look in these chests, uh, just to, to grab everything that I can find. I don't think anyone's been to this corner, uh, because quite a lot of the, uh, the chests are empty over here. So I think it's quite a good place to hang out. It is becoming night now, though, so the googlies are going to be spawning soon. So uh, that's going to be uh, something else for us to look out for and there's loads of people left still only one person's been taken out and there's a creeper spawn egg which I just don't even want to bother with I just don't I don't even care about that that's not going to be a good thing for me to spawn in because I know I'm just going to end up blowing myself up and I love the um the boundary of the map as well. Have you seen that they've built like all mountains and clouds and all stuff around the outside and this massive uh, white fence around the outside as well just looks really cool. And is there anything here? Nope, nothing in the chest there on that that massive burger. Right, what I might do then is I might go and start heading back towards the, uh, the centre of the map. Uh, I think normally at times like this when we've been playing for a while, people generally uh, slowly start to make their, their way back to the middle. So I think that's the, the best chance I've got of finding someone. Quick look in this cherry pie. Anything nice in the cherry pie? Nope. <laughs> Uh, just uh, an axe that I don't really need and whoa! Nope, just leave him, just leave him. Don't even bother fighting him. It's not worth it. <laughs> Saying that, I do have knockback, so if I needed to, I could. And here we go. Oh, look, there's a fight going on here. Right, is that creeper still going after me? Right, the creeper's still going after me, but uh, those two people are fighting over there. Or have they teamed up? There's two people pretty close together, but they seem to be not going for each other anymore. Right, I can't really deal with them while there's a creeper here. Right, should I go try push in then, shall we? Oh, look, there's a guy crouched behind, behind here. They have no idea that I'm here. Right, let's splash them with the harming. Let's go take them out. It's Longbow. It's Longbow. There we go. I managed to take out Longbow. Let's steal all of his loot. Did he have anything good? I don't think he had anything that, that I really needed. He had an iron sword there, but I've got that anyway. Uh, he didn't have a chest plate, did he? Uh, oh, an iron helmet. I can put that on, though. That's pretty handy. And uh, I got three pieces of iron as well. And here we go. There's someone over here being chased by, like, a, a mob of googlies in this direction. I think this person's going to get taken out by themselves. Anyway, I don't even think I need to take them out. Uh, this is Chloe over here. Let's go and try and take her out. There we go. I managed to take out Chloe as well. Something's hurting me. Oh, there's all creepers and all sorts over there. I saw some iron on the floor, though. If I go and try and... Oh, if I try and pick that up. Oh no, this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. Oh no, no, I'm getting really hurt. I'm getting really hurt. Here, oh no, there's a creeper. Run away. Run away, run away. Splash potion of healing. And then swiftness. And how am I still alive? Half a heart I was down to. Half a heart. And I managed to survive. That was incredibly lucky. Uh, but there's going to be googlies all over the place. And look, there's some more iron down there, I think. Is that someone chasing me? Okay, it's only googlies. It's only googlies. I can deal with the googlies because they don't chase me down too much. <laughs> Something's really hurting me, though. I think that was the, the skeleton there just hitting me constantly. Whew. I kind of need to, need to regain my composure a little bit there. And there we go. Fear was just taken out by Jake. That was the person who nearly killed me. Fear was the person who went straight after me. Oh, this is this is getting intense. I don't know how many people are left. Everyone's starting to, to back out as they get taken out. I kind of want to find a safe place to hide where I'm not going to get blown up by a creeper. And then I can go and see how much iron I've got if I can make myself an iron chest plate. And I've only got four pieces of iron. That's not going to be enough. Uh, but I did manage to get uh, another splash potion. Oh, splash potion of weakness that is there. Uh, so I can go and grab that and have that at hand as well. And uh, what's this? I've got another splash potion of... Um, uh, of swiftness as well, and so I can use that if I need to, to make a quick escape. And there's not more iron armor I can make. No, I need more more iron. I'm feeling good though. The problem is though, I think it's I think it's Jake on the Xbox that's left as well, and because he survived so long, uh, he's probably got as much good loot as me. Is there anything else that I could wear that I need? Uh, nope. I think I think I'm pretty much set and ready to go into the battle. I know it's me, Jake, and Finball left. There, there's three of us left in the battle. So whatever, I've got either like gold, silver, or bronze. So <laughs> whatever. I'm going to take this as a, a small victory, but it would be it would be nice to become the final victor. Uh, so let's go and try and track them down, shall we? Uh, let's go back to the middle. As I said, that's normally where people generally tend to head to. And uh, I was right, wasn't I? There was uh, a lot of activity going on uh, around the, the middle of the map, wasn't there? Uh, I'm kind of getting a bit lost. I think it's over this direction. There seems to be a lot of light in this direction, which makes me think uh, there might be... Uh, yeah, this might be the spawn. And it is, but there's nobody here... 
Hmm, okay. Well, seeing as I'm sprinting around really quick with swiftness, I guess I can I can just sort of sprint around. And oh, nope, it's just run out. All right, let's go head back in this direction then. Gamer tags are left on, uh, so it should be easy enough to, to spot someone because you can see them from quite far away. And here we go. I have found someone. I can see someone in the distance. I think they've just crouched. And oh, no, leave me alone, Google. He's right. Okay, let's just ignore them. Let's try and escape from them because I don't want to be getting shot on the back as I try and take someone out. They're hiding over there somewhere. I saw them for a second, and now they're mysteriously disappeared so that I'm being ready to, to get ambushed and oh no I'm just getting ambushed by all the, the googlies leave me alone <laughs> I've got enough trouble with the, the other players I don't need you guys going after me I want to find somewhere where I can get the high ground maybe if I hop up here uh, this might be a good way to, to get the advantage on someone if I go up here and shoot arrows down at them maybe uh, that might be quite a good plan can I see anyone coming? Oh, that's a creeper. Woo, I'm glad I've got not back. <laughs> right, is there any chance of jumping up here if I jump out and up? There we go. That was quite a fancy little jump. Uh, anyway, so I've got a bit... Whoa, leave me alone. No. Ow, 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 ow. Is the person still nearby? Okay, I kind of half expected the person to be watching that and then just charge in the second I get hurt. Oh, there we go. They've just stood up again over there. Right, I know where they are. So what I want to do is I want to shoot arrows at them. Then when they get close, I'm going to splash them with weakness and then just charge in for the kill. Oh, they've got lots of armor, though. Look how much armor they've got on over there. Right, let's make sure there's going to be no googly sneaking up behind me, shall we? Oh, they got a good hit on me. That I just hit the, the spider that was going for them. I think that's Jake on the Xbox there, and he's got a spider going after him. I'm just hitting the spider rather than him. There we go. I got a nice good hit on him there. Right, let's go charge in, shall we? I'm going to use the swiftness now just in case I do need to, to make a quick escape. And then let's go charge him down then, shall we? I just go and immediately splash him with weakness and then just go in with my sword and try and finish him off. There's so many googlies all over the place. They say, oh god, he got a massive hit on me there though. That really hurt me actually. Well, that's, uh, that's probably enough to, to make me want to back off to be honest. Uh, I just kind of wish the googlies weren't here. Like, I'm trying to fight him but there's just creepers and all sorts all over the place. Alright, let's climb up on top of this thing, this packet of whatever this is supposed to be. Let's go and try and shoot some more arrows at him, shall we? He's got a spider in his face as well. And there is... Oh, look! Here's the other person! Here's King Finball coming up behind me. Right, I'm sandwiched in the middle. I do not like this. Let's just get out of here for now. Let's try and lure the other two to each other and then hopefully if they go after each other and then get each other weak, I can go and try and run in and just get the other person. Right, is Finball going to come up behind him? I think he is. There we go. Now Jake on the Xbox, he's the one in the middle. They're going to fight each other and be left weak. And then here we go. Now I can run in and just try and finish him off. Oh, and there's a creeper there. I just weakened the creeper. I just fired a weakness potion at the creeper there. Oh, Jake's got swiftness as well, though. This is the final kill. If I manage to take him out, I'm going to be the winner. He's just out of my reach, though. And I'm half expecting him to just turn around and go after me. Go on, Stampy. You can get him. You can get him. Oh, he's so quick. <laughs> this is just like a, a race between the two speediest people in the world charging after each other. If he gets hit by one of those other goodies, there we go. He's turned around. He's going now. He's trying to fight me. Oh, he's trying to get his arrow out. If I try and get him close, there's a zombie behind him as well. There's a zombie going after him and there's all creepers as well. Is the creeper going to blow him up? And it did! The creeper blew him up and I won! <laughs> yes! Yay! I'm the victor. What an epic end to the battle. I was so close. I only had three hearts left. That could have gone either way. That was good. I think I was quite strategic there, which is very rare for me. Normally, I'm just running away like a coward and hoping that I win. <laughs> I think that went really well. I managed to take loads of people out, and I ended up winning. Overall, jolly good fun. Hopefully, you all enjoyed the video, and uh, whoa! <laughs> I don't even care anymore. I've already won. <laughs> yeah, hopefully you all enjoyed uh, the uh, the video. And the map was amazing, wasn't it? Look at this place. Uh, I did actually say I was going to go and have a, a quick fly over at the end. So let's go and uh, have, a, have a quick overview. Uh, I think it actually looks even better in day uh, because it's not uh, very lit up. But you can still get uh, a good idea of uh, how cool this map is. Certainly uh, one of the uh, the favourite maps that uh, I've seen on the Xbox. Look at that bunny. How adorable is that? <laughs> and here's the the massive butty, uh, buttyfly? Uh, butterfly over there. Uh, yeah, so overall. A fantastic map and there's going to be a link in the description uh, to a download of the map uh, if you want to go and download it and play it for yourselves as well as a, a link to the uh, the builders if you want to go and check out their YouTube channel, uh, as well as uh, all of the channels of everyone else that was playing in this game. So maybe some of them are going to upload this gameplay as well, and you can go and watch it from their point of view. Uh, anyway, that's the end of this video here. I want to thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you all later. Bye!